Hey there engineers! Ever wondered about those handy scraper tools? Today, we will delve into the ABC of scraper tools, breaking down their types and uses. Let's get scraping! We're going to take a closer look at the main types of scrapers in just a bit. But before we dive into that, let's start by understanding what exactly a scraper is. Scraping involves smoothing out elevated areas on a surface to ensure parts fit together accurately. This helps to eliminate carbon accumulation from various components like cylinder heads, pistons, and crankshafts. The tool used to perform scraping is called a scraper. The first one on the list is flat scraper. A flat scraper is a tool you use to scrape on flat surfaces. Its sharp edge is curved outward, kind of like a round shape. They come in different lengths ranging from 100 mm to 300 mm. The cutting edge is created by grinding one side at an angle of 81 degree. Next is the half round scraper. It's also known as a bearing scraper since it's used to scrape bearing surfaces. The half round scraper comes in a shape that's like a half circle. Three square scraper is shaped like a triangle. Along with this it has three sharp edges. This is why it is called it a triangular scraper. This tool is used to sharpen the edges of bush bearings and to scrape the inner spherical surface. These scrapers are named bullnose scrapers because they look a bit like a bull's nostrils. People use them to scrape surfaces that are flat or half round. The cutting edge is on a circular disc shape, covering about two-thirds of the circle. They're really useful for scraping big bearings. To do this, you can either scrape along the length or move around the bearing's outer edge. People use the two-handle scraper for scraping big flat areas and also for scraping sizable curved surfaces. The last on the list is the hook scrapers. It looks a bit like a flat scraper, but its tip is bent at a 90-degree angle. So, it's used in places where a regular flat scraper can't reach. The hook scraper makes scraping the center of big flat surfaces very easy. That was all about the main types of scrapers. If you have any questions do let me know in the comments below. Also, feel free to let me know if you would like to see a video on any other topic. See you next time. Goodbye.